Hello, my name's Rich and all I'm going to do today is show you a little demo of using a Pebble in conjunction with your phone, in my case a HTC One V, with Tasker and Pebble Tasker. And what I'm going to do is um, activate my uh, portable Wi-Fi hotspot because whenever I'm out I always switch on uh, for my Nexus 7 because my phone's quite slow really so it's better to use my Nexus 7 uh, and it's a non-Wi-Fi model. So first of all, I'll give you a quick demo of what I'm going to do. What we've got is just a standard Pebble with the uh, Pebble Tasker watch face or app. Sorry about the glare. And if I click on there, you should see it loading. And then I've got three options, hotspot on and then two, which say no task assigned. So I'm going to hit the hotspot on. Then I'm not going to do anything else with my phone. But what you should see is the menu coming up. And now Tasker is doing the work for me. Going through the menus there, you should click on more, then down to portable hotspot and tethering. And then it should activate the portable hotspot. And hopefully up at the top here you should see um, it come on any moment now. Okay, there you go, hotspot active. And then you can just turn it off or you can press the hotspot on and it'll turn it off as well. It's probably a better way of doing it, but um, that's how I do it. Okay, so one click on the pebble activates your Wi-Fi hotspot. So I'm going to just take you through um, the little recipe for it. Oh, that's pebble tasker, sorry. If we go to tasker. Okay, so what I've got here is my profile. And all I'm saying here is um, load an app and then I'm giving it a task. So I'm saying load app, app settings. So I want to actually load the settings for the phone. Um, and then what you do is you go into input and D-pad and then um, button down and in my case five times. So let me just explain that. What that's actually doing is when I want to turn on the Wi-Fi, okay, that's what I'm saying initially, the Wi-Fi hotspot. I'm saying load the app settings, so that will load this menu. And then I'm saying go down five times, so one, two, three, four, five. And then if we look back in here, I'm saying press one times, so press on the fifth, and then it'll be down one, two, three, four, to portable hotspot and tethering. Oh, it's actually three there. And then button press repeat twice. So down three times to portable hotspot and tethering. And then press, it needs to press there, and then again on the hotspot. And then that will activate the uh, portable hotspot. I hope that um, explains it. And just to demo it again, hopefully it will work properly. I just close everything down anyway, but here we go. Let's see. So press once there. It opens up the settings. Down one, two, three, four, five. And then it should press. And then down three. One, two, three. Press. And a press and there we go um, I must uh, point out that this needs a rooted device I think it works anyway on a Samsung device or something because I'm actually kind of changing a tutorial I'd seen but I know there are certain models found where d-pad works and some that it doesn't if it doesn't work for you then it's because your device isn't rooted I hope this has helped and um, you can use this for any app you want to use, loading up other apps and things like that using the D-pad and button presses. But thanks a lot, um, please like, comment and subscribe. Thanks for